Brace yourselves, sports fans, because we're diving headfirst into the Hill family saga, a story so steeped in drama and triumph, it rivals the most gripping of Hollywood scripts. This isn't just a collection of touchdowns and tackles, it's a whirlwind of raw passion. With skills so astounding, they leave audiences utterly speechless. Fasten your seatbelts, because this narrative is all about carving indelible marks in the NFL marks that echo through the ages. Before we launch into this adrenaline-pumping journey, a quick shout-out. Hit that subscribe button, folks. Love stories that set your pulse racing? Then don't hold back. Smash that thumbs up to show your support. Now, are you ready to dive into the legendary odyssey of the Hill family? Let's get this show on the road. Born on March 1, 1994 in Pearson, Georgia, Tyreek Hill was a shining star at Coffee High School. He blazed through the 100 meters and 200 meters at the 2012 Georgia 5A state meet, streaking across the track like a comet in the night sky. On the football field, Hill was a jack of all trades, a master of versatility. As a running back, wide receiver, punt returner, and kick returner, he was a dynamo in all 11 games, averaging a solid 135 all-purpose yards per game. But hold on, there's more. He skyrocketed to 307 all-purpose yards in a game against Delta State, only to end the season with a jaw-dropping negative three all-purpose yards against the North Alabama Lions. Flashback to Hill's days at Garden City Community College in Kansas, a dual threat in track and football. In his sophomore year, 2013, Hill was a touchdown machine, rushing for 659 yards and five touchdowns, and catching 67 passes for 532 yards. Coming out of Garden City, he was the guy every college wanted. But Oklahoma State University snagged this rising star. August 30th, 2014 marked Hill's debut for the Cowboys, where he made a splash with six catches for 62 yards against the Florida State Seminoles. Then came the Texas Tech Red Raiders game, where he scored his first career touchdown, racking up 50 yards on three receptions, 39 yards on six rushes, and 62 yards on three kick returns. Against the Iowa State Cyclones, Hill was unstoppable, amassing a season-high 148 kick return yards and scoring his first kick return touchdown of the season. And who could forget November 1, 2014? Hill tore up the field with 102 rushing yards and his first rushing touchdown of the season against the Kansas State Wildcats. His last game as a Cowboy? A display of sheer talent and determination. Zoom into 2016, and Hill's making waves in the NFL. Starting as a return specialist, he quickly showed off his lightning speed and agility, earning the nickname Cheetah. His rookie season? Nothing short of spectacular. He was selected for the Pro Bowl and named first team All Pro as a punt returner. Hill's versatility shone bright as he played a key role in the Chiefs' offense and special teams. September 7, 2017, season opener against the New England Patriots, and Tyreek Hill is setting personal records with 133 receiving yards from seven catches, including a jaw-dropping 75-yard touchdown, propelling the Chiefs to a 42-27 victory. In Week 5 against the Houston Texans, Hill was a spectacle, returning an 82-yard punt for a touchdown. By 2018, Hill had cemented his status as a top receiver in the league. His performance that year was stellar, earning him another first-team All-Pro selection. He became a crucial part of the Chiefs' offensive juggernaut, known for making big plays and scoring touchdowns left, right, and center. 2019 was a roller coaster for Tyreek Hill, the Kansas City Chiefs' wide receiver. Off-field issues and injuries couldn't dampen his on-field brilliance, contributing significantly to the Chiefs' successful season. Hill's year kicked off with a suspension due to a child abuse investigation, but by July, the NFL cleared him, not imposing any discipline under their personal conduct policy. This was a pivotal moment for both Hill and the Chiefs, given his crucial role in their offense. Hill's season hit a snag early on with an injury against the Jacksonville Jaguars, sidelining him for several games, but his comeback in Week 6 against the Houston Texans was nothing short of spectacular grabbing five passes for 80 yards and scoring two touchdowns, despite the Chiefs' loss. Hill was instrumental in leading the Chiefs to a 12-4 record, clinching the AFC West title and securing a first-round playoff bye. In the postseason, his impact was undeniable. Facing the Houston Texans in the divisional round, he had three receptions for 41 yards and a staggering 51-31 victory. And in the AFC Championship against the Titans, he caught five passes for 67 yards and scored two touchdowns, contributing to a 35-24 triumph, leaving touchdown. 
The standout moment came in Week 12 against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, where he made 13 catches for a career-high 269 yards and three touchdowns, steering the team to a 27-24 win. This performance etched his name as the first player sign. Fast forward to 2022, and Hill began a new chapter with the Miami Dolphins. His transition was smooth as silk, as he continued to display the explosive speed and playmaking ability that made him a star with the Chiefs. His presence on the field remained a constant threat to defenders, solidifying his place among the NFL's elite receivers. As of 2023, Hill's stats are jaw-dropping. Over 700 receptions, close to 10,000 receiving yards, and a plethora of touchdowns. His consistent performance over the years has made him a regular at the Pro Bowl and a key player in his team's successes. Throughout his career, Hill's speed and agility have been his superpowers, making him a formidable force on the field. His journey from a rookie to one of the most respected receivers in the NFL is a story of hard work, dedication, and exceptional talent. But wait, there's more to this incredible story. Let's shine a spotlight on Tyreek's siblings, Latarsha and Seth Hill. Latarsha. Tyreek's elder sister and the only sister has always been a pillar of strength and independence, a true role model for Tyreek. She's not only a nurse, but also a single mother, juggling responsibilities with grace and resilience. And then there's Seth, Tyreek's younger brother, following in his big brother's footsteps on the football field. A student at Alabama State University, Seth's got game, having shown his medal in football back at Coffee High School. He's not just Tyreek's brother, he's carving his own path in the world of sports. All right, sports enthusiasts, if you're loving these tales of triumph and legacy, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more thrilling stories. Now, let's take a step back and explore the roots of this remarkable family. Rewind to the beginning, and you'll meet Derek Shaw, Tyreek's father, a Georgia narrative with American roots. However, much of Tyreek's story is shaped by his mother, Anisha Sanchez, a single parent. She juggled multiple jobs, single-handedly supporting Tyreek and his two siblings. Hill's early life wasn't a walk in the park, with his father out of the picture and his mother grappling with the challenges of single parenthood. Yet, Anisha was a pillar of strength and encouragement, tirelessly working to keep her family afloat. And let's not forget the crucial role of Hill's maternal grandparents. They stepped in, providing a stable, loving home for Tyreek and his siblings, playing a key role in nurturing the future NFL star. And there you have it, folks, the final buzzer for today's episode. We've just taken an epic journey through the lesser-known yet utterly captivating chapters of Tyreek Hill's family history. The saga influenced Tyreek's path. Should it be a highlight in his career reel? A huge shout-out to all our viewers for tuning in. I hope this deep dive was as enlightening for you as it was for me. Remember, I'm not going anywhere. I'll be back with more enthralling stories just like this. So until next time, keep your spirits high and your game even higher.